writers, you're going to need these things to edit. An editing checklist, a book that you want to publish, and a pencil. The first thing on the editing checklist is I can read my writing. That means we need to read our book and make sure that we can read it. This page says, let's play with your Play-Doh. Yeah, I can read that. Let's check this page over here. Piggy says, my Play-Doh dried out. Yep, I can read that too. I can mark off the first thing on my editing checklist. I can read my writing. Now I'm ready to do the second part. Now I'm going to focus on whether or not I put spaces between my words. Here we go. I see good spaces between each word on this page. Let's check over here. My Play-Doh, oh dear, look right there. There's no space between the word dried and out. I need to edit that. Okay, I edited my word. I erased the word out and I put it down below so that it would be easier for the reader to read. Now I can check off the second part of my editing checklist. I'm ready to work on the third important skill. That is checking the word wall to make sure my snap words are spelled correctly. When I check the word wall, it's important to have my yellow writing folder. Inside is a word wall. All right, I'm checking the word let's. Yep, that's spelled correctly. Play is another snap word. Yep, looks good. With, oh dear, I need to fix that. With doesn't have an F at the end. It has a digraph, T-H. Now let's check the word your. Oops, I forgot a U. I'm going to edit the word your so it is spelled correctly. All right, I checked the page to make sure my snap words were spelled correctly. Wow, look at that. I have checked three things on the editing checklist. Now I am ready to make sure that I ended sentences with punctuation. Let's play with your Play-Doh. Yep, there's a period. Let's check the next page. My Play-Doh dried out. Oh goodness, no ending punctuation there. Let me think about Piggy, how she's feeling. She's feeling sad, um, might be a little upset. I think I'm going to just put a period there. Okay, now I can check off that I checked all of my sentences for end punctuation. I just have two more things on my list to check off. Right now, I'm gonna to check to make sure that I use lowercase letters um, unless capitals were needed. And capitals, we'll check to make sure they're at the beginning of the sentence. Oh no, when I zoom in, I see some uppercase letters that shouldn't be in the middle of a sentence. I better fix that. Lowercase p, lowercase l, lowercase a and y. Let's play with your Play-Doh better. And look, I have a capital letter at the beginning. Let's check over here. Yep lowercase letters and only a capital at the beginning. Look at that, friends. I can check off the last two things on my editing checklist. Look at that. I used the editing checklist and now I've made this page easier for the reader to read. But guess what? I have to turn the page. And now I have to do all the same jobs for this page too. So writers, today you are going to use your editing checklist to make sure your stories are easy to read. Remember to read one page at a time and check each item off 
on your checklist. Off you go.